A portrait of grace and devotion, Nicolas de la Juliers Elizabeth Throckmorton, canoness of the Order of the Danes Augustines Anglaises. Nicolas de la Juliers, 1656-1746, was a French painter who specialized in portraits, still lifes, and historical scenes. He was also a prominent member of the Royal Academy of Painting and Sculpture. One of his most elegant and refined works is Elizabeth Throckmorton, canoness of the Order of the Dames Augustines Anglaises, painted in 1729. This painting depicts a noble woman and a religious sister in a portrait that reveals her dignity and piety. Elizabeth Throckmorton was the daughter of Sir Robert Throckmorton, a baronet and a Catholic convert. She joined the Order of the Dames Augustines Anglaises, a convent of English nuns in Paris, where she lived a life of prayer and charity. She was also a friend and patron of La Juliere, who painted her portrait as a gift. Elizabeth is portrayed with a serene and gentle expression, looking at us with her grey eyes and coral pink lips. She wears a voluminous garment that covers her head and forehead beneath a black veil that falls over and past her shoulders. This is the traditional attire of her order, which signifies her devotion and purity. The garment is pleated across the chest and sleeves, creating a harmonious contrast of light and shadow. A wide panel covers her shoulders, the sides of her neck, and head, and a white band crosses her forehead. The semi-transparent black veil creates a stiff peak over her head, adding a touch of solemnity and elegance. She sits facing us, resting her right hand in her lap and holding a small book with her index finger marking her spot. The book may be a prayer book or a breviary, indicating her religious practice and learning. Her other hand is presumably tucked under the folds of her garment, suggesting her modesty and humility. The background behind her is peanut brown, and a diagonal line suggests a curtain pulled to our right. This creates a simple and neutral backdrop that focuses our attention on her face and figure. An inscription in capital gold letters spans the right half of the painting along the top edge, Elizabeth daughter of S.R. Rothrock Morton Bart. 1729, this identifies her name, lineage, and the date of the painting, adding a touch of prestige and history. La Juliere's painting is a masterpiece of composition and expression, using light, color, and texture to create a vivid and convincing portrait. The light from the left illuminates her smooth skin and flushed cheeks, highlighting her features and fabrics. The colors are muted and harmonious, creating a warm and cozy atmosphere. The textures are varied and realistic, from the silky veil to the pleated garment, to the leather book and the gold letters. The gestures are expressive and natural, conveying the emotions and personality of the subject. Elizabeth Throckmorton, canoness of the Order of the Dames Augustines Anglaises is not just a painting, but a portrait of grace and devotion. It shows the beauty and nobility of the noble woman, as well as the faith and charity of the religious sister. It invites viewers to appreciate the art and skill of La Juliere, and to share in the experience of Elizabeth. It is a testament to La Juliere's talent and vision, and a delight for the eyes and the mind.